The Christmas season is long behind us, which means these are either headed back in storage or to the nearest landfill. Thankfully, a partnership in Elkhart is making sure these stay out of the garbage and end up on someone's tree in 2024. The process is simple. Once the Christmas tree finally comes down, grab any lights that you no longer need and place them in the box right outside the Elkhart Environmental Center. Uh, people can drop it off anytime we have a box outside, so even if we're not open, people can drop stuff off. From there, Shoe Pan Recycling in Elkhart purchases the discarded lights and acts as the first stage in a long process of reintroducing the lights to a new environment, one not riddled with trash. So it's a nice little exchange because we, in turn, am going to ship it off uh, after we get a very large box of them. We'll ship it off to our customer who will melt it down and reuse the copper that's in it. It's safe to say that the partnership between the two Heart City businesses has been mutually beneficial for each organization and for the environment, which no longer sees the addition of dangerous chemicals. You're talking a combination of things. You've got plastic, which is nothing but chemicals. You've got copper. Instead of it being wasted, it can be recycled and it can be reused for something else. With more than 300 pounds of lights recycled last year alone, their goal of pushing forward the growing trend that recycling really matters is looking better with each passing year. A lot of people are becoming more and more aware of the importance of recycling, and so it, it is growing. It also helps people feel good about doing the right thing with their stuff. It's not just going into a piece of land where it's going to sit forever. Um, it's going to be made into other stuff, and um, we're conserving resources by reusing stuff instead of mining for new uh, metals and things like that. It's a program with humble beginnings, but huge aspirations. I would love to see this this program grow, grow, grow to the point to where no one is throwing this stuff away. The drop-off is available for anyone wanting to discard their old lights in a way that's environmentally safe all the way through the end of the month, January 31st. Reporting for Globe News, I'm Dante Stanton.